Welcome back, friends, to another episode of Science, where in today's episode, I want to take a look at something that came up on a Logical uh, Geek Boy video, where he was building a new type of gold farm, and he had mentioned that he needed to build it as low down in the nether as possible so that he would get the best spawn rates. But I remember reading somewhere in the notes uh, that 1.18 was going to be removing that feature, so spawn rates should be the same everywhere within uh, the various Y levels. But I also remember them saying that build height was going to be going to whatever it is now, uh, but that did not impact the nether. So I'm curious to see if the spawn rate is actually going to be any different in the nether or if it's going to be the same. So what I've got here is I've got a very simple uh, perimeter, essentially, where I cleared out uh, all the way down. Uh, this bottom magma block is down at y equals 1. So this is just a very small gold farm example at the bottom of the world. What we're going to do is we're just going to compare uh, the spawning rates down here. And then what we're going to do is we're going to go all the way up to the build limit and we'll build the exact same size platforms and compare the two. So I've got Carpet Mod installed, which is a very handy uh, mod that lets you track things such as the mob spawning. So if you take a look here, uh, we've managed to spawn 6 ghasts, 22 magma cubes, 991 pigmans, and 1 piglins. So you can also see the breakdown of the various hourly rate. So that is what we're going to be using to compare this uh, sample setup to one about 200 blocks higher in the world. Okay, so we've gotten our data point. Been letting this run for a little bit, just continually spawning. Keep in mind that the number that we're trying to compare to was 5,149 zombie pigments per hour down at y equals 1. So why don't we see where we at now? We are at 2,411 per hour. I may not be an expert, but 2,400 sounds a lot smaller than 5,100. So it does seem that there is a little bit of a difference between the Y levels. And by a little bit, I mean a lot. So it does seem like there is a strong, strong case for making your gold farms down at the bottom of the world, but that does include a lot more work. But if you are absolutely dead set on getting as many spawns as possible, which would then lead to higher drop rates, this does appear to be the better elevation. Build it as low as you can, so the lower in the world you get, the more spawns, and the higher you get, the easier it is to build, but also the lower your spawn rate is going to be. So I just wanted to say thank you so much for joining me today on this episode of Science in Minecraft. And I hope you guys have a great day, and as always, tell your pets that I love them very much.